Hi guys, how's it going? Welcome to a new video. Uh, this, as the title will allude to, will be uh, an unboxing video. Um, received a package today in the mail from uh, an awesome YouTuber, one of my good friends on here, and a guy I'm sure a lot of you will be familiar with, and that's Chris Webb, aka Chris J Webb One. Very, very sound guy, great collector, um, great friend to have on YouTube. Um, done quite a few kind of swaps backwards and forwards now, doing you know, kind of sending each other a wish list and stuff like that. Always kind of cool to do a nice little trade like that. Um, kind of you know keeps things a little bit fresh and it's always nice to get a little bit of a surprise in the mail so like I say I got in from work and uh, had this uh, cool package waiting for me uh, which woke my wife up this morning which is uh, bad for her but great for me so we're gonna crack it open guys and see what's inside this bad boy um, as always I'll put uh, Chris's link below for you all to check out click on his click on his link go to his channel see what you think I'm sure you'll I'm sure you won't be disappointed like I say excellent stuff and a really sound guy um, so we shall crack into this like I say I sent Chris uh, a wish list a while back um, something we, like we kind of do every now and again just to keep it kind of fresh and just so you can get a couple of cool surprises in the mail uh, there's a note and it says the following hey Stephen uh, hope you're doing good buddy I am thanks pal uh, so here is the package of blu-ray goodness I have sent um, in here you will find a few things off your list and also a few extra little goodies. Dear me, it's a big box so you've, uh, there's definitely a few goodies in there buddy. Um, it's great doing these trades and swaps with you as you're a sound guy and it's awesome knowing you. <laughs> uh, very nice mate. Your videos are always fun to watch so keep them coming. I look forward to future trades. I hope you like what's inside. Take care mate, your friend Chris. Chris J Web one very nice and very kind words there buddy, thank you very much. Um, right, we're going to start off, if we can get this on camera a little bit. Um, right, yeah, let's have a look. Very uh, well packaged, as always mate, excellent stuff. Uh, <laughs> right, the first one we've got is um, A Profit. Uh, now I haven't seen this film, it's been on my wish list on Amazon for a long, long time. And I've just never got around to kind of watching it and I've got... You know, a bunch of my friends are always telling me, you know, you've got to see this, and uh, I get tortured for not having watched it. But I'm sure it's a, it's like a, is it a French crime thriller? Uh, a lot of it takes place in a jail, uh, a kind of uh, a notorious prison. Um, Scarface meets The Godfather, so that's a pretty bold claim on the front cover there. So if you guys have seen that and uh, you enjoyed it or you didn't enjoy it, uh, let me know. There's plenty of special features on this as well, deleted scenes and uh, documentaries and screen tests. And uh, yeah, it just looks like a really kind of uh, gritty kind of like prison crime thriller. So I'm looking forward to checking that out. So that's a profit. So thanks, mate. Excellent. Like another one I can tick off my wish list. I've got like an Amazon wish list that's kind of started to go into multiple pages now. So it's uh, it's good to kind of tick things off it. The next one is a film I've been after for a long time, and that's Gandhi. Uh, Really, really great film this. Uh, I think I caught it on TV not that long ago. Was it TCM or something like that? And I was watching like the last kind of half an hour of it and realised that I don't think I've ever owned this on... A, I've owned it on VHS, I'm sure, but I've never owned it on like a DVD or anything like that for some reason. And really kind of uh, got the taste for it again. I'm getting into my kind of big epic films uh, again. And a bit of trivia on this. I think, I'm sure I read somewhere one time that this was... The final film, the last film to have an intermission, you know, like an in, when they have intermissions uh, back in the day, if you like, uh, with like kind of epic films, you know, they'll kind of break so everybody can go to the toilet and, and get some snacks or whatever in the theatre. They don't do it, you know, now, um, but I'm sure that this this was the last one. Correct me if I'm wrong, I'll have to IMDB it and, and, and double check, but I'm sure this, is, this was the last film uh, to ever have uh, an intermission, and this was 1982, so that's... I think that's when intermissions are fin uh, officially finished. So correct me if I'm wrong, but this is one of the um, Sony Classics collection uh, with the slip cover on, uh, Spy number four. I've got quite a few of these. I'm, I'm, I'm probably going to end up building the whole collection, but bags and bags of special features on this. Uh, I haven't read anything about the transfer on this yet, though, so I'm hoping the transfer is going to be pretty cool because uh, it definitely deserves it. Great, great um, Richard Attenborough film starring the excellent Ben Kingsley, winner of eight Academy Awards, so excellent stuff. Right, next up we have, <laughs> cheers buddy, this is excellent, this is one of my favourite, 
not my favourite films of all time. Maybe one of my favourite kind of war films of all time. But this is uh, Eastwood and um, Richard Burton in Where Eagles Dare. Uh, I love this film so much. Uh, just, I really could like, you know, I could watch it again and again and again. You know, that's that kind of film. Uh, very kind of twisty, turny plot if you haven't seen it. Um, pretty cheesy in places, you know, it's kind of got Eastwood and uh, Richard Burton posing as as Nazis to break into a kind of Nazi stronghold. Um, uh, there's a lot of kind of double crossing and uh, kind of twists and turns in, in the film. Um, I've read, I actually read that the transfer on this wasn't that great. It is a kind of gritty looking film anyway. Um, but, you know, just to warn it on, on Blu-ray is very, very cool. So that's where Eagles Dare. Brilliant stuff, mate. Thank you very much. Very much appreciated. And we also have in here a couple of... Uh, Oh my goodness. So, uh, you spoiled me mate, you spoiled me. Uh, absolutely amazing. Uh, he sent me the digi book of Poltergeist, if you can see that. Um, and I've been getting quite a few digi books lately, Amazon and places like that. I've been having them on sale and it, there's something that I've never really kind of got into. I, I've, had, I've always had a few of them but I'm really starting to build up a kind of big collection of them now. Uh, and I'll do a video in the very near future of some of the the more recent ones that I've got, um, but sent me Toby Hooper's uh, Poltergeist, very very cool mate, uh, too too much mate, you spoiled me rotten, you spoiled me rotten, uh, that is excellent, and there's another one in here I think, is it a, a digi book as well, it's not is it, it's a steel book, unbelievable, <laughs> oh mate, he sent me the steel book of the Shawshank Redemption, I don't know if the camera's going to pick that up, because uh, of the lighting, if you can see, that is outstanding, mate. Is that the French Steelbook? I don't know. Is it the French one? Ah, is it the Canadian one? It's the Canadian Steelbook, I think. Wow, that is, mate. I'm uh, I'm speechless, as you can tell. Uh, I'll just double check. There's nothing else in this package because it's uh, that's amazing. But yeah, that's that's the that's the Canadian uh, Steelbook, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong, mate. Of the Shawshank Redemption. Uh, that is awesome. The cat's just walked past there. Uh, hello, mate. Um, oh, what a film. Mate, I'm speechless. You know, they're two kind of surprises that are uh, kind of above and beyond. That is excellent, mate. One of my favourite films of all time. Um, I'm not really familiar with this steel book. Uh, in fact, what we'll do now is we're going to crack it open. I don't usually... I usually leave, leave this for kind of a separate thing, but we're going to open this because I'm so ex I'm excited about it. Excuse me. Let's have a look. Right, so there we go. There's the back as well. We've got Tim Robbins and Morgan Freeman there, if you can see that. And then inside, it's a one disc edition and the artwork depicting all the uh, inmates at the prison. Very, very cool. Mate, that is tip top, very unexpected, uh, but very, very appreciated. Um, I'm definitely, I'm definitely going to have to send you something out because uh, you've gone above and beyond and spoiled me far too much. A steel book and a digi book uh, to add to my collection, as well as ticking three awesome movies off my wish list. Um, top stuff. Uh, what can I say? What more can I say? Guys, please click the link. Please click uh, Chris's link. Go check out his channel. Uh, very, very sound guy, as is evident by this amazing package. Um, Chris, thank you very much, mate. Uh, far too much, but as, a, as like I say, um, like I say, sorry, uh, appreciated. Uh, definitely got something cool lined up for you. I'll have to send you something cool out uh, as a thank you uh, for that. Just for the Shawshank Steelbook alone, that was awesome. So, thanks again, buddy. Right, thanks for watching this unboxing, guys. Thanks for bearing with me and listening to me uh, kind of dribble on a little bit and, and um, make a mess. Uh, I'll be back very soon, uh, hopefully at the beginning of the next week in a few days time with, um, I'll probably do, um, I've got an update to do, uh, but I'll probably do a, maybe a digi book update first because I've had a few digi books come through. I think I'm waiting for one more, I think I've got, um, I think I've got one more due. So hopefully that'll come at the beginning of the next week and I'll try and get a video made.
when that lands. Uh, and then after that, I'll probably do my update. So it'll be like a kind of end of February update, if you like. Is it nearly March now? Yeah, be the end of February update. Because uh, there's a few things to get through in there as well. A few cool additions. Um, but in the meantime, guys, uh, thank you for watching. Like I say, thanks for bearing with me uh, throughout this unboxing. Uh, take, care, guys. take care, guys. Uh, always appreciate your support. Always appreciate you watching my videos and uh, commenting. And I'll see you all very, very soon. Bye-bye.